the confrontation between the flagships NVIDIA and AMD is postponed, the release of the RTX 3080T depends on the sales of RX 6900 XT. The new generation of AMD graphics cards is impressive. Gamers received super powerful solutions that can compete on an equal footing with NVIDIA cards, bypassing them in many respects. Especially unexpected was the Radeon RX 6900 XT, which at a price of $999 is able to compete on equal terms with the GeForce RTX 3090, the recommended price of which goes beyond 1,500 evergreens. This alignment turned out to be an unpleasant surprise for NVIDIA, which in a hurry began preparations for the release of the GeForce RTX 3080T with 20GB of video memory. As it became known, the initial plans to release such a video card in January were cancelled, and the new flagship will come to us no earlier than February or even later. Against this background, a reasonable question arises, what is the reason for this decision? There is an answer, it's all about AMD, which has ceased to be a competitor for NVIDIA for several months. If you do not believe, then take a look at these two materials, 1 and 2. So, the GeForce RTX 3090 is already on sale at the manufacturer's recommended price, and the GeForce RTX 3070, although more expensive than the official price, continues to fall in price. Against this background. There are no red team video cards at all, but the GeForce RTX 3080T was conceived as an answer to the Radeon RX 6900 XT. It was assumed that the grains would put the same price on it with roughly identical performance. Well, now everything depends on AMD again. If the company manages to arrange supplies, having received a sufficient number of usable chips, then we will face another round of confrontation between the flagships. In any other case, the Reds will continue to lose ground, since there is nothing left in stores except for the Radeon RX 5500 XT.